contraption? I don't know. I got it. It's uh, meant to be a crossbow, but each know. of the crossbow it, arms have like axe blades on them. But oh, wow. But I got it at a garage sale with only one of like the crossbow arm. It didn't even work, but it just looked cool, so I kept it and eventually threw it away. Nice. It really is bloodborne. Yeah. That is, yeah, that's very, very bloodborne. Well, are we back live? I can see it on my Twitch. Me too. All right, we're back. So yeah, does does uh, Enten normally glow like Goku when Mina yeah, sees does, him through does, uh, does detect he's glowing, magic? He's glowing a little bit extra. Just a little bit. Okay. Like, just more on the general aura, or is there, like, another spot that's... Is there, like, the thing on his forehead is glowing extra? Okay. It's, but it's wait, what school of magic is he? Yeah. Um, if it's a specific school. Now he's invocation. Ooh. But was he before? Like, uh. Invocation? You mean evocation? Uh, yes. Invocation. That's what I meant. I'm stupid. Yeah. No, you're not. Fight me. I knew what you meant. I will fight you. What was he before? <laughs> Oh. I'm not trans. Wait, transmutation and enchantment are two different, very different schools of magic, Gray. I need, I need I know, one. But like, his, All his of them. Forehead one was enchantment. Oh. And his body was like a weird transmutation sort of issue. But now he's I, is, I would assume the gems are more abjuration. Oh, abjuration. Am, am I getting abjuration? Like. Enchantment abjuration. is like charming and like abjuration's fear. protection magic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, then yeah. My schools of magic aren't. I'm not smart. That's fair. So Mina just kind of nods. Yeah, you're you're glowing different. You usually glow, but like now it's a different color. I and. The more I focus, I'm pretty sure it's a different kind of magic, too. Like, before it was very, like, like protective and it kind of locked something down, and now it's more like, blah, you know? Um, no, I way, don't know. I would like each I... Pick a number between one Seven. And eight. 69. 67. What did you say, Enton? 77. Damn it, that's what I, that's actually what I was gonna choose. In the in the quest portal chat? Um, um Do they all have to be different? No. Then I'm also choosing seventy seven. It was just us three. I said everyone. Oh, I thought you said us three. I think you specifically said you three. Oh. I'm dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize that the stuff that I was posting was coming on on the right. Never cry. Like what? Uh -huh. One to number one through 80 and pay attention. Sorry. Uh, 26. Post it in quest portal chat. I don't know how. It's called you choose the chat button on the right side of your screen. Why is it called that? That's such a weird thing to call it. I know. Chat? Why would they call chat chat? That doesn't make any sense. I know. Anyways, you guys continue. Oh god. Uh... Okay. I don't really understand what you're saying, Mina, but I kind of get it. Like, the, the type of magic changed. I, I get that part. But, like, what was he before and what is he now? Um. Mina focuses for a little bit longer. Um. You, uh, you had said that overall his body was uh, abjuration to start. And then now it's evocation. 
think the gems were abjuration. He was transmutation. The gems okay. were aberration, and now he's evocation. Then Mina explains that. Am I, am I gonna explode? I don't think so. Not more than know. usual, I'd imagine. Uh, Mina, just where do you see the focus of this energy, or is it just everywhere? Uh, it's kind of just everywhere, from what I can tell. Oh god, like it's just kind of like a. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, exactly like Goku from our favorite book series, Dragon Orb Z. Okay, uh, Anton, stay still. Why? Because I'm going to cast Identify on you, and I need you to stay still. I take out Petra's earring and begin spending 10 minutes casting Identify. While that's happening, Mina's just gonna kind of... She's not gonna leave this area, but she's just gonna kind of look around on the ship to see if she can see any magical, like, auras coming from anywhere. The magic of homosexuality, I understand. <laughs> Why, it's true. Love is the greatest magic okay. of all. Just make up um, words. Was it the light haired or dark haired one that was concerned about the ballista last game? Okay. I'm taking way more detailed notes about these lesbians than I need to. No, you're not. These guys are working for the Blue Witch, so. Does Anton say that out loud? No. That, I know great. it. I know it. These these two, they're working. There's something suspicious about them. It's canon that Anton is extremely homophobic, by the way. <laughs> Hate that. Based. No, don't say that. <laughs> As a lesbian, he's based. Thank you. But eventually, that'll happen. Ah. Cast identify on Enten. Weird. How does it feel? How does it feel for me to be identified? I was. I was. It comes back as he him. <laughs> what to do? Uh, I mean, it's just sort of 
condensing and dispersing magic power like sucks up magic power into it and then just shoots it out into the air kind of magic radiator it's like a the magic humidifier okay It's basically just like a spell focus, though. Is there any more detail you could give on that, Gray? Or is that just it? She comes back, her her head like flicks back minorly, blinks her eyes a couple times. How is it? Am I gonna explode? Like Mina said I would? Mina never said that. And now I wasn't able to identify you. I don't know what the uh, Lord of the Skies did to you. He said we'd learn next time we were in a fight, right? I think that was the Supreme God telling us that. I don't think he told us anything. Oh, okay. Yeah, he told us that we would learn the next time we're in a fight. Oh. You did say that. I thought that was Gray saying that. There's Gray saying that in the voice of a sky god. Well, I mean, like you said, you'll find out eventually. I don't think he would go so far as making you explode. If he did that, that's pretty counterintuitive based on what he had said. If he does that, he'll have the Wrath of the Gods on him. <laughs> he didn't say much to me at all. He just said it, that I wanted to, he wanted to help me and then did a thing and said I'll find out. But like... Yeah, I don't, but I don't think he'll go as far as doing that. Because like, if you wanted to help, why would he make you explode later? Why would he not just blow you up then? You're the one saying it's gonna explode. No, I'm not. No one said Enten. You said it's all evocation now. That doesn't explode mean you're you going to explode. But that doesn't mean you're going to explode. That means you can make things explode. Or do other things with it. Yeah, doesn't but it's all me. Mean... Well, like, Enten, this, and she just, like, um, Mina just, like, holds up her book and, like, touches it, and it starts glowing. This is evocation. Like, evocation doesn't mean explosions. It just... It means, like, it creates, like... It just does things. Like, just like every other school of magic, it's very general, and all of them can do a lot of different things, not just explosions. Point being, you'll be fine. You will be. You didn't help me much. I said it might not work. I'm, I'm sorry. I tried to feed more magic to Zephyr. Just spamming lightning bolts into that guy. Uh. 
Is there anything else anybody else, or anything else anybody wants to do for the day, or do we want to continue on to the next? Bimba awkwardly retreats to the back of the ship at the end of the day, or after that conversation. Mina will come hang out. Are we skipping the next day? Yes. Okay. Uh, does, although I'm important, uh, Bimp, are you able to sleep? Oh, okay. I guess, yes, I am. Oh. Didn't we make it a will save last time? Or a whiz save? Use the path I believe so. It's not a save, it's if you do it, it's con save for fatigue. Well, that's, that's, like, that's the save to not be exhausted, the save to actually fall asleep and, like, resist the bad memories, I believe, was a wisdom. Coward. Just say yes or no. I rolled an 11. Wisdom saving throw. then now you'd probably have to do the the constitution save which boosts to a 15 yeah it's got to roll an 11 or higher that's not too bad I rolled a 14 in total no that's an 18 total okay nope by five unless I, in general we're changing it for home rule Oh yeah, I guess. But like it, like it says in Xanathar's guide, it, DC 10 con save, increasing DC by five for each 24 hours you go without long resting. <laughs> but that is valid to just make sure to shut up as you do that. That's DMing, making shit up as you go. Yeah, we know. We don't play by D&D rules here anyway. We do whatever we want. Oh, fuck, that was me. <laughs> Boo, Wizards of the Coast bad. <laughs> We're not contractually obligated to say that they're not bad. They are bad. I can't speak. Anyway. The next, did you say the next day was also uneventful? Uh, yes. It's just a day we... of um, Nebuchad doing work and like learning shit. The, by the way, the captain like stands next to you and he like reads your little thing in the jig. And he goes through, um, and helps you with, like, we'll say one a day. Um, except for the ones that, like, you have to wait to dock for. Um, but, on the, let me see if there's a spot to dock, okay. On the third or fourth day. Is it the third or fourth day? On the fourth day. Uh, 
has stopped at a dot. <gasps> where? At, um, it's where it touches the... What That's city is this? Uh, hold on, I'm gonna tell you right now. I was getting to it. I thought you meant like where on the map. No. You guys stop at this little. The little boober. And shit. I couldn't see your ping. What? I saw it on the stream. I didn't see it. Right there, at where the end of this is. Oh. There. Oh, now I saw it. That was me. But how do you how'd you do that? Double click. Oh. So is this a large, uh, it's like a large medium town? As I thought it was. A place called Port Claron. Wisdom save. So you can't sleep that night. The fuck is the DC? Goddamn. The DC for the. Oh, wait, oh, wait, no. Never mind, you slept the previous night, so you're fine. Yeah. Sorry. My brain, again, my brain's all fucking backwards with these. I'm like. Big number mean no sleep. My brain's not smart, but no. So you passed because it was reset to again. I never slept though. I, I've just rolled a wisdom save to see if I could go to bed. I failed the last wisdom save. Oh, shit. Okay, then and I made the con save. Oh. That... Making the con save means I don't take a point of exhaustion. But that means I failed my wisdom save and didn't sleep that night. To succeed the wisdom save, it means I slept and don't need to make the con save. Oh, okay. So you rolled a 15 on your wisdom save? Yes. Port, right? I 
Is it Oakwood? Oakwood. <laughs> Listen, I didn't write it down, and then it immediately left my mind. Alright, so, you guys land. And you are able to... Get off the boat, stretch your legs if you want. Um, Mina is probably just going to go to the captain and ask what we are stopped for. He says, uh, we're still a trade vessel, so we need to pick up supplies. All right. I guess I wasn't, I wasn't entirely sure whether or not there was still trading going on, so it's good to know that we're not impeding anybody by being on board. Onward, and she just kind of awkwardly shuffles away. Hey, Mina. Yeah? Tossed as a handful of iron shavings in the air just makes you big. <laughs> Mina just, like takes the- has an idea for a moment and considers it and goes in her head, fuck it. Shoots out the wings that are already like a gigantic wingspan normally and like shoots up into the air super high. Probably like knocking people over with the wind in the process. That a dex or a strength saving throw because I was right next to you. <laughs> Doesn't matter, I rolled a three, I get knocked on my ass. Actually, because of the fact that Mina had never, um, like in character, given you a, uh, uh like a flying around ride, he just reaches down and grabs you <laughs> in one hand. I, I don't think she'd actually, well, Grim's pretty small. Do you, do you think? Mina, do you think Big Mina would be able to grab you in one hand? Yes. Because you have yeah. advantage on it, too. So yeah, she just reaches down and picks you up and <laughs> shoots into the sky. So this is an interesting city. <laughs> um, People are going to be freaking the fuck out in the city. <laughs> Sorry, continue. I can't wait for Mina and Bim to get shot out of the sky. <laughs> that would be kind of funny. I had a moment of debate in my head, like, above table, where I was like, this would probably be really a, like a super bad idea and a horrible waste of uh, a resource that could be needed if we have some kind of actual encounter here. But Mina's an impulsive 15 year old, so. Yeah, I did use the second level spell slot on you. <laughs> <laughs> Big wings. slow occasionally okay wow well, your mic just changed and you got a lot louder what the fuck a woo jump scare a woo jump scare i honestly did nothing maybe it was my connection that like got interrupted and fixed itself i don't know
I don't know either. You okay though? Your ears, your ears, he's okay. Yes. Yeah, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm good. Okay. Okay, so we've got that one. Oh, we do have a maximum file size. Got it. I see, I see. Just a reminder to cycle your music so that it doesn't stop for all the players. Mm-hmm. How big is that file? Actually, I think the music has stopped. Yeah. Like, stopped, stopped. Yeah. I'm almost done, but... I'll save this scene for now. Oh. Can't wait to get in and immediately make Mina's uh, token way too big. Here we go. We'll save that scene now. And then we're I'll... Gone. We're gone. Oh, I just seen deck. Variants. That one. There we go. This is all you need for now. There we go. I didn't hear any background audio, though. Oh, refresh your page, maybe. I don't know. You, you have turn off music off, right? Like, uh, turn off yeah, music I have. Off. I have. A, I have it turned on. Weird. I can hear it. Wonk. Leave the game and re is everybody return. Yeah, is everybody else getting audio from Quest Portal? Nope. I will try fully leaving and then coming back. Uh, I did that and it's still gone. Baby, 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 baby. Oh. Yeah, I, um, if you just, if you close the tab and then reopen it, like follow the link again, that opened it for, or that brought music back for me. That's so silly. It just there. be like that sometimes. Yeah, uh, Mina just shoots up into the sky off the dock and flies around for like 45 seconds and then like dive bombs and then stops and lands uh, as gracefully as she can.
roll an acrobatics. Do it. I'm not doing it unless the DM tells me. Because <laughs> um, high speed falling damage sounds terrifying. Uh, I think you're fine. Okay. Damn. Mina knows well enough to, like, dive bomb to be cool, but not, like, cut it too close. Whoa. Oh, God, it's changed. It's different. It's changed. Why is this an abandoned ruin? What? I don't yeah, know. Changed, like, a castle. Oh, not that one. What the heck? Oh, it's because I saved oh. it. There we go. Wonky. Um, but as you guys were coming, you guys did pass by that keep. Uh, because Whoa. this is the city. Ignore the name Runeport, because it's not called Runeport. Whoa. Damn, it's taking a... Oh, shit. You guys are at the bottom of the dock, though. Is this notable locations she or uh like key accurate or no? Uh yeah, why not? Cool. Yo, there's a fighting pit. <laughs> <laughs> we should yes, go. For the children. Let me fix the squares really quick. Oh hold on. The grid. Oh. Uh, because the grid is not accurate. Why one square is equal to five feet? <laughs> there we go. And snap to grid. There we go. Now we'll go back. And it should be correct now. What? Yo, there's an alchemist tower? Oh, shit. Alchemy? At, at, yeah, it's over by the keep. It's A. Moon Reservoir. It's a repository. I want to say it's like a knowledge place, like a not sort of like a library, but different. A place building or receptacle where things are to be stored. Wild. So I was wrong. Anyways, so you guys are here, and I'm going to move you guys back to the dock because that's where you guys actually are. Um, if you guys would like to continue exploring the town, you're more than welcome to, but... Oh god, ah! we've disappeared. I think you guys got knocked off the map. We it's... fell in the water and drowned. Got kidnapped. Actually, if you zoom way out, you're all the way down there. What the fuck? It's probably because... I don't I know moved. why, but it's saving what? per map. <laughs> tiny, tiny. Oh god. I'm just gonna drag Bimp on there once again. Oh, did it save the grid? Whatever. Okay. Um. So, Anyways. do we want to do anything, or should we just should we find something to do in town while the ship's in port, or should we just chill out, or what? How long is it going to be in port? Uh, they've got to re they've got to stock up, negotiate for uh, items and everything like that. So, like a day. Yeah, um, it's going to be most of the day. Okay. 
They'll probably be ready to leave by nightfall, but they'll probably stay the night in an inn. So, looking to all of the other Chosen, do we want to just chill out on the boat, or do we want to find something to do in town for the day? This is a trading town, so there's a whole bunch of stuff to do. But this is still very much so Midvale, so... Nevacrab? Enten? Spirit? I? Did you not care? I... Oh, if we were leaving in the morning, we can do something that doesn't take too long. Yeah, I mean, it seems like we've got a day here to, to do something. We could just chill out, but... I mean, we've been on the boat for like... four or five days now, so... Be nice to get out and walk around a bit on uh, floors that aren't moving. What if we get lost? Um, we ask for directions back. Yeah. Town. This town doesn't seem that big from what we saw on our way in on the boat. Um, I mean, we managed to make our way around frickin' Alcatran pretty well, and that's a way bigger city than this. Right. On a scale of 1 to 10, how sunburnt is Nevercurd right now from working shirtless on the boat? Um, he's, uh, he's pretty sunburnt, but the duck, um, gave you some some cream and when you sleep with that cream overnight um it ow it uh soothes the sunburn and uh you wake up just lightly tanner than what you were before what? and nice. as you tan so... as you tan the sunburn keeps getting less and less and soon nice. you're gonna be a little go tan bed. boy nice but i'm so i'm a little pinky pie right now yeah, just a little bit. You're like a tan little... You, you got like a little like pink pinkness going on. It's not like it doesn't hurt yet. You know tomorrow it would hurt, but the doc already gave you self. You just gotta slap it on. Rub it on. Nice. Well, I've got my medicine, so I, I'm down to party tonight, you know? <laughs> so, should we just find someone nearby and ask for something that we could do <laughs> I, somebody who looks like they know what they're doing we could probably I, I, somebody on the ship has probably been here before we could probably ask them for something to do for the day um is there any like crew members who we like know a little bit who are around on the dock still or they have they like uh, made their way into the city at this point they're actively working. The only one that's made their way into the city is the captain. Um, just because he is actively negotiating prices and stuff like that. But everyone's still on ship, like, getting ready, like, to... Preparing stuff. I bet we could ask Birdie. I feel like Birdie might know something about the town. You want to go do that? Sure. Alright, let's go find Birdie. And Mina turns back around and goes back towards the boat. I follow. Valid. But does Bert, does it seem like Birdie's still around somewhere, or are they yeah, are they like she's she's actively on the boat, like just uh, double checking tie downs, like she's she's doing stuff, but she's not like super crazy busy. So Mina will run up to Birdie, still probably with a few feathers from when her wings disappeared, uh, stuck to her clothing in various places. 
Uh, Birdie. Hmm? Oh. Um, do you know anything about this city? Um, seems like we're going to uh... be here for a, a day, so... Uh, we wanted to know if there's anything that we can do go and do or anything that we should go and see while we're here. Well, um, there's a few things. They have a keep, and that's fun to look around. Um, I would say possibly... Oh boy, there's a bunch of shops, a bunch of little things to do. There's an inn not too far. Um, that's a lot of fun. Uh, but you're a little young, so... I don't know. What are you guys looking to do? Um, Mina just turns around and looks to everybody else. What do we want to do? Hey, it's always fun nope. to just walk around and go look. Maybe something will catch your eye. We're fine with that. I just want to help someone. Well, Let's go find I don't someone see you help, doing I much. I don't see you doing much of that. Just sitting around. Now, now, what do you think? I like the way you think. And then Nevercred's gonna like spring up and like start packing. Wait, where are we right now? Are we by the bunks? No. I imagine uh... we were on the main deck of the ship. If we were, ch if Birdie was checking for like tie downs and stuff. Probably. I like the way you think. And Nevilkrid's gonna run back down towards the lower deck and start gathering his things from his bunk area. Nevilkrid's just gonna sprint away in conversation. Uh, okay. Uh, thank you for the advice, Birdie. Um, she goes, she well, says, uh, let me think. There is, uh, in the middle of the city, there's like a pretty little reservoir thing. It looks really cool. It goes all the way down. It's, it's fun. Um, uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. you can watch fights. There's, um, like I said, there's a tavern. There's a housing district. Whole bunch of stuff. Uh, this is... Uh, Wait, let me think. we can watch fights? Yeah! Um, there's the fighting pit. It's, uh, over near the... Uh, it's, it's not too far from here, actually. Uh, if you head out... If you head out the gate, you immediately make a right, and then the first chance you're able to, you make a left, and you're right there at the fighting pit. And that's allowed? Well... Yeah, the next city that we're gonna go to, slavery's legal, so... Well, slavery's not legal, but it is legal. It's... In the books, it's illegal, but people still do it anyways. It's... Kind of just a thing. It's Silk Shore. And it just blinks <laughs> with all of her eyes, like... What? Yeah, so like sometimes... <clears throat> Sorry. So sometimes escaped slaves head up this way, and they don't really have anything else to do, and they're good at fighting, so they go to the fighting pits, earn some money, you know, make a life for themselves. And some people really like it and decide to stay. It's pretty cool, actually. Um, it helps people just, like, kind of make their own in the world, you know? Anyone can join. Except you guys. You're too young. Wait, so are there slaves or not slaves in Silkshore? There are slaves in Silkshore. This is not Silkshore. I thought you were still talking about Silkshore. No, they come up here to the fighting pits. Okay. Well, that's interesting. Eh, that's life. Shouldn't be. Well... There's a lot of things that shouldn't be, but what can you do? I'm just a sailor. We're the chosen, so... That's fair. And like I said, it's technically illegal, because it's still in Midvale, but... Um... 
Wait, where is slavery legal? Zenistrat. It's on the border of Zenistrat and Midvale. Technically Midvale's territory. But, you know, with everything, the lines get a little blurry. Got it. Well, yeah, um... Don't worry about it. Because of the whole uh, illegality, um, the tactical illegality, they have to take really good care of their slaves or servants, as they call them, um, or else they get busted down. So they're treat—they're at least treated really well. I don't think that actually makes it better. Really doesn't. She shrugs. Better than what they do don't over in. Uh, in let me see really quick. Where's the next place? Better better than what they do in Elven Scar. Slavery is slavery. Doesn't matter if it's better than they do it somewhere else. That's fair, I suppose. But like I said, there's nothing I can do about it. So. You cannot excuse it. Hmm. That's. I suppose that's fair, but. If I just got infuriated every time I went there, then that would be kind of a miserable life since I go there all the time. Anyway, let's go help Nevercred get his stuff together. And so, Mina just real awkwardly starts to leave. As we're walking away, she. Bimp whispers to Mina, we're, we're gonna try and fix that, right? Yeah, Mina looks back to Enten and Spirit, assuming that they're with us. And also, Bim, we're definitely gonna, like, at the very least, report that when we get back. If not, try and do something when we're there, right? Yes, I want to do something in Zenistra, but that's probably gonna happen later. Yeah, I mean, we can't immediately diverge our entire mission that we're currently on to go and do this, but, like, as soon as we get back, that's... I feel like that's a bigger deal than any of the other stuff we have in our play right now. Yeah. Yeah, we should, at the very least, report that when we get back. But... These... This town, it isn't that, so let's try not to let that ruin her day. I don't say anything as we head downstairs. As you guys, like, are heading downstairs, you're gonna, like, in Nevercred's gonna be, like, in his Fjord Scout uniform with a small knapsack walking up the stairs. Oh, hey guys, what, are you guys ready to go? Um, oh. Yeah, we yeah if to, you're ready. We were just coming Sorry. to help you. Oh, I just had to put a shirt in. Oh. Okay. Um, yeah, then let's go. So what did I miss? Library? Was, There's a I was muted, but Spirit oh. looked uncomfortable with that conversation. That's fair. Uh... So, this place has a fighting pit, apparently. Um, and also, Silk Shore, the place we're going to be getting dropped off at. Uh, slavery's technically illegal, but people still have slaves anyways. And apparently, slavery is legal in Zenistrat. This is real fucked up. We're gonna do something about that, right? <laughs> so that's what we said. Yeah, at the very least, we need to report that when we get back. I mean... How do we know? Uh, Birdie told us. If Bert, a little Birdie told us. No, <laughs> Bir Birdie, Birdie. Like, and no, Mia know. turns around and points at Birdie, who's probably, like, walking along doing something. If Birdie knows, then I'm certain 
other people know. I don't think it's a secret. I don't think the government's going to do anything. Well, we, because, I mean, this is a ship. Like, this is, to, like, it's possible that there are things that are known by the people on the crew who that are, like, that isn't common knowledge. And, like, if we tell the government to do something, I, they might, I would hope. We could threaten them to stop being chosen if they don't do it. I mean, isn't Zenistrad a different area with different rules? That's why it's legal there, but we're still the chosen. Pretty sure and we have the same lead, like the same sway we would in Zenistrad than we do here. I don't so. know if people are going to be willing to just give up what they have because a couple of kids told them, regardless of who we are. That will well, make them. We can overthrow a government in due time, but... You know what, regardless, th th that's that's a lot for right now to get... That we, We're in a town that doesn't have that, so let's try not to make that the whole thing while we're here. <laughs> we'll cross that bridge, or we're at, we'll attempt to cross that bridge when we get to it. Oh, on to the fighting pit, I guess? On to the fighting pit. Is that where we wanted to go? I don't know. That, that, that seemed like the most interesting thing that was said. We could also just walk around and see what else is here. I'd prefer that part. Okay. What do people fight in the pit? Each other, I think. Yeah. Oh, to like air out your qualms so that way you can start fresh and make friends? Or just someone random and you make money off of it. Yeah, I think people kind of just beat each other up. Cool. But. I mean, it feels weird. It does. Yeah. 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 I mean, Dennis shot at slavery, though, so. <laughs> yeah, but, but I mean, that's not I guess weird. It... That's just evil. That's fair. Yeah. I mean, it's both, but... It's like, it feels weird to call it just weird. But let's, let's go into the city. I need to just, like, does a real awkward turn and starts walking. <laughs> I follow. So, you guys go. I'll change the map right now. Remember, it's, it's been syncing the tokens, so you guys are going to be at the top of the map. You can move yourself. I, I have audio again. Does everybody else? Yes. yes. Okay. So, back down to where we were. <laughs> I'm so tiny. I moved you. I moved. Why am I so big? Oh my god, I'm 6'2. Oh my god. Spirit what? huge. Big spirit. I'm tiny. <laughs> very, very small. What was the city name where there's slavery that's illegal and we want to tell the government? Silk Shore. To... Silk Shore. Silk Shore. Okay. Uh, are there people like on the stock? Is it like kind of bustling? A little bit. Nevocred is going to stop the first person who will entertain him saying 
Excuse me. Who do I stop? There we go. I fixed the grid. Now it's correct size. Ish. Because this is... For, uh... Watch him call it's shit. Zero percent grid opacity, so it's not laying over. Um. Okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Oops. Um. You can talk to all of these people here are dock workers. There's some Goliath, there's like like a just like a bunch of different types of people. I want to look for a person who doesn't look like they're they live on a boat or are like piratey. I wanna look for the least piratey person. You're gonna have to go deeper into town. Oh, so we're judging people based on looks now, are we? Yep, but Nevercut's still gonna stop the first person and say uh, whoever. I guess we'll go to the dock workers. Uh, excuse me, friends. Um, are you aware that in Silkshore there's slavery? They look at you with, like, a dumb look, and they're like, first time near Zenistrat? Uh, yes, but I just wanted to know if you knew, because if you know, then other people might know, and that's all I really wanted to know. Thank you for your time. And then he's gonna, like, just start walking deeper into town. That's the disheartening. Guy and continues working. So, it's not just the boat people who know that there's slavery here, so I'm, I'm starting to think maybe, you know, even our abbots and abbesses know that there's slavery in Midvale, and you've just got better things to do. I, I'm, I'm making a very, very poignant note of this in, in, in my list of things that we're going to need to talk to the abbots uh, and abbesses about once we get back. But, um, onward, I guess. I assume Dendrick's just staying on the boat. Yeah. He's baking bread or something. Anti-social man. Making bacon bacon pancakes. pancakes. I'm hungry. I can't eat until 10. Hat loser. Fuck you. I'm eating right now. It's 11.27, Gray. No, it's not. You're just from the future. I'm from the middle future. From the milk um, future? What? <laughs> middle. Oh. <laughs> This is 1027 for me. All right, let's. I wish I was from the mill future. Let's take a quick little break and get our bearings about us. And by us, I mean me. And uh, let's stretch our legs, have a little bit of fun, and we'll be back in a few minutes. Anyone use the restroom, grab a bottle of water, do whatever you need to do. I'll be right Don't back. Don't tell me what to do. Shut up. Oh, okay.
<laughs> Starling said time to forget about slavery, and you said please don't. I was saying please don't, because Gray said that they were going to send me to gay baby jail. Oh. That's mean. I am mean. Thank you. Okay. Oh, we're back. Welcome back. Hello. Time to... You a chicken? I'm a turkey. That's a turkey, turkey sound. Yeah. Same thing, really. Alright, so we start walking around in the city. <laughs> Making my way Sorry. downtown. Ah, oh, shit, you're already downtown. Walking slow. Making my way uptown. Hold on, I got little legs. <laughs> It's like that one. Oh, I'm just gonna type it out. Uh. Why? Okay, I keep rubber banding. Wink. <laughs> right. So, uh, wandering around, what do we see? Which way do we go? Left, right, or straight? I vote left. Left is away from the fight pits. This is true. Let's go left. Left we go. Oh no, I wrote slug instead of your character. How dare you. There we go. Uh. It's fixed. There, if I'm more betrayed in my life. All right, DM. What do we see if we take a left? You see the jail. Oh god. I don't. I don't know what you were expecting. This is just a little town. Well, I don't know. There's something called a rune reservoir. That could yeah, be that's magical. Great. We don't know that. Oh, well, I mean, it's, we could have seen it from where we were. It's like four buildings down. This is true. Could we have actually seen it from... If you can't yeah. see something four buildings away... I you know, know it's bad eyesight. <laughs> oh, you know There's what that too is many true. eyes. And nobody's thought of giving her glasses yet. Oh, never cared. You wanted to help someone. Where do you give an instinct on where someone that needs help is? I don't know. The slaves in the next town over? We can't go there. You'll be there in, in like a week or two. Week and a half. Week and a half. Oh yeah, something's supposed to happen in the city. Let's roll oh, no. one through five. Oh, that's not. Oh, no. <laughs> Yahoo! Y'all ready to get mugged? Yeah. You feel the ground shake beneath you. Tur three terrasses come out of a chasm. The thing that terrifies oh. me is that I definitely feel like I remember seeing this map somewhere. You saw and it before break. Yeah. Something. I, I have a bad feeling, but... There are ruins in the city. You think things just can't be old and break down in the city? No, that's where all the poor people live. Oh. Uh. Not that one. Uh, does there look to be any shops around? Like, inter like interesting shops. Oh, in the there area are... that we're headed. I thought you meant the ruined keep. No. Uh, <clears throat> there is. Hold on. S and L are weird, like the. What's S? Like the whole northeast or northwest section of the city is like 
Yeah, kind of there's like a bunch of shops over there. And to V, too. What, what's V? Repository. Oh. No, that's a storage place. Yeah. I see that. Yeah, I looked up, not like, the definition of a repository building, and it was like, a building where things are done. It was like, There's a building a where certain types of commerce can happen. Commerce like, is buying and selling, so that's But it, the... it was like, it was more general than that. A place building or a set of core things are or may be stored. Looking up the for repository building definition, a building or place that provides a particular service or is used for a particular industry. So, a building. It's not a building though. It's a if you look, it's got like a bunch of tent area things. Anyways, that aside, um, you can go the other way for shopping, but it, going that way, uh, there no. is mostly, like, you're getting closer to the keep, and that's where, like, a lot of, uh, like, guard how- the, it's- you're going towards the cops. Ooh, cops. So? Let's just pick a direction and go, everybody. That seems interesting. Just points at, uh, like, what was it called again? The Rune Reservoir? The Rune Reservoir. Reservoir. You guys want to go there? Ah, rotated. Oh god. Get rotated, bitch. I rotated myself. Enten. Ah, 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 ah! That wasn't me. Enten? Oh, okay. Hmm. Oh, you just weren't saying anything. Didn't have much to say to it. Y'all making the decisions here? Did you make the grid really small? Why is it only making me go a little bit at a time, Gray? Uh, cause I don't have it snapped to grid. Oh. I didn't realize you could move with the arrow keys, that's wonderful! Now it's snapped to grid. <laughs> this is so dumb. I love it. Blake, it off Twitter. Oh, you were back. I thought you were posting in our server again. Oh. Oh, oh fuck, never could got the moves. <laughs> you guys crashed my quest portal. It just suddenly stopped. <laughs> it's gonna take me oh, oh god. It crashed for me too. <laughs> it does not like you guys talking. Doesn't us like us fucking break dancing in the street? <laughs> it's just all the chosen doing that one like break dancing gif meme, like in perfect unison. I don't think I know that one. You, I, Where I there's feel like just the person standing, it. and then there's the little person in front of them break dancing. Oh yeah 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 yeah. Ow. Okay. So we hits. all approach the the big the Rune big reservoir. water feature. You guys see familiar faces. It's the boat lesbians. Yo. Where are they at? Hold on. My goodness. The lesbians. We made the right choice. To Time to turn to my dedicated out. boat lesbian note page. Mm. 
Do I have a pirate token? The characters that my gay polyamorous ass would be flirting with if we were not children. I can just make them octopus. What if they're not poly? Then I won't flirt with them. Fair. But until I know. Hello. Hello. Not you. Oh. I have so many tokens, this is going to take me a second. Uh, let's go back to... Okay, found them. The gays. Um, yeah. I. Yeah. I zoomed in way too far. They sit there. Well. Well, one sit there and one stand behind. She's like the start of a souls like boss fight. <laughs> Cross a random bridge into a really cool area. And there's people just waiting for you. The boat lesbians are the blue witch. Mina will just kind of cross the bridge and look around and give the two of them a wave. Can I see over the edge, or am I too short? Uh, there's little, like, dips where it goes down the, the, the wall. Like, you can see over where the dips are, so, like, right, right here, and right here. Can you see my little clickies? Yes. Yeah. But the big the big ones are too big. Oh, ow. What? What? Sorry, I sneezed and it really hurts when I sneeze. Still. Sorry. Bless you. So You're fine. Oh. So, you guys walk up and they give you a slight wave. Ah, uh, hi. Um, I don't think we were ever, like, formally introduced uh, on the boat, but... Hello. The lighter-haired one just kind of says... Hi. The darker haired one just kind of like gives you one of those little head nods. Where they like tilt their head upwards like sup. They go and they say um buff, buff, buff. I have their names written down. Shit. That is notes for a different game. Um I'm Bonnie. This is, or I'm Edith. This is Bonnie. The darker-haired. Shut up. The darker-haired 
uh, gal says. So dark hair is Edith, E-D-Y-T-H-E, and light hair is Bonnie. That spelled B-O-N-N-I-E or B-O-N-N-Y? Yeah. Okay. B-O-N-N-I-E. Hola. It's nice to more properly meet you. Um, I'm Mina. These are the other chosen. Nice to meet you. Most of you them, at someone, least. You need someone to show you around the city. I, we can show you. Um, I mean, if it wouldn't be too much trouble, that'd be great. No, of course not. <laughs> she says most enthusiastically. Like, does she seem like she's just like that, or is she being sarcastic? Um, yeah, don't know. You've never seen her not be like that, so... Well, um, where would you recommend going for people who haven't ever been here before? You can see the older part of the city. Those buildings are kind of interesting, although... It's a little bit of a mess. There's still some characters there, if you wanted to go check it out. Um, and in what direction would we have to go to get there? North. We can go with you. Oh, all right. Oh. Uh, what about this place? She just kind of, I mean, it just kind of gestures to the whole, like, water feature thing. This, this is I all, mean, um, all the water here is seawater. It gets converted to fresh water for the town. Here. Okay, One so... One of the exports from here is sea salt. They collect all the, all the salt um, and sell it to merchants. Um, above, above table question, um, Initially, like visually, I was reading like the center thing as like a pedestal with a big blue water orb above it, but now it looks more like it's a well, and I feel like that makes more sense. Yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, because um, all the water goes down, and this is like it's up, but the as they get more like rainwater and stuff, the reservoir sometimes will become full. Fuller. Oh. That makes more sense. <clears throat> anyway. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was looking at what um, what uh, Blake posted, and I saw right above the gif, Hello, naughty children, it's murder time. That's just one of my favorite, one of my favorite things. Anywho. Um, they go and they... Sorry. Let me see if I can find more. Oh, that's a quest portal. I want to go look at more maps. Um, the nice. Okay, perfect. Sorry. I I want to have this open so that I can find more maps in the future. Um, the. Uh, Bonnie stands and is just waiting for you guys. Mina will just kind of lean over towards where, like, lean over the side of the railing towards where Bimp is and kind of call. Bimp! What are you doing? Looking. Fair. Um, 
They said they'll show us the like northern part of the city. Are you going to come with us? Oh, sure. Hi. Looking back to everybody else. You're all coming with us, right? Mm-hmm. Let's go, then. On a magical lesbian adventure. Well, you... Oh, God, you... you fell into the well. Ah. Ah. I should have saved my wings for this. <laughs> Wait, don't crash Gray's Crest Portal. Yes, please. All right, um, so you guys are, um, I'm stretching, I'm sorry. Bless you. Um, you guys are able to head up, uh, she's still going to be sitting because I'm not changing her token. Um, oh God. She's just special like that. <laughs> Lesbians just cool. like, like just moving around in a sitting position. Yeah. Not even her legs aren't even moving. She's just gliding. Yeah. It's they like lead a you to character. one of the buildings. Who's glitched? And they go. Uh, in here used to be a bookstore. There's still some books in there, even. Um. There's a bunch what? of little places. An old tavern that's destroyed. Shops. What? This what used happened? to be. This used to be a keep. Um. One where people would defend. Um. One day this place got raided by some pirates. They attacked the center of the city. Uh, they could have rebuilt, but a lot of the merchants just gave up and left. Now it's the slums. That's Some of the lame. shop areas still aren't used, but... Especially this bookstore, people don't really care for books when they're, you know starving you want to go check it out oh, yeah it, is this one the bookstore yeah the one on the left mm -hmm. uh yeah mina just kind of steps up and like kind of has a like an obviously curious look to her um yeah i mean there could be some like really funky stuff in there <laughs> She hears herself say that and is like, what? What? And, but continues onward. So you can head on in. Um, anyone else who wants to go in and check it out is more than welcome to. They kind of I stand will. right outside the door, um, letting you... Uh, letting you walk around and check it out. Uh, Enten... Nevacred and Spirit, do you head inside of the bookstore? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yes. yes. <clears throat> Anything about you probably wouldn't be here, but Mina, can you detect magic? Yeah, I mean, if nobody who knows what to look for has come in and cared to look, then the wings shoot down in front of her face and the eyes all open and start to glow and they all just kind of point in different directions like they're all searching for things. Just kind of roll um, around and look all over the place. There is no um, magic in here, but I need everyone to go ahead and roll me a perception check. Mm. They're assassins. Murderers. I roll investigation instead. <laughs> No. Sad. Ooh. That's a seven. That's a nine. It's a seven or a nine. That's a an eight. 
Oh, you said perception? Seven. Yeah. And that is a unnatural 20. Uh, me too. 19. Everyone who got above an 18. Um, here's the doors get messed with and then some laughing as retreating footsteps Mina I walked to the door <laughs> did, did they I tried to open it the door is indeed locked Except nope. at this door, is it locked? Um, when you head that way, you find a small bedroll, and that the wall is a little bit uh, destroyed. Uh, there is debris blocking the door. Um, if you scooch, you'll see it. Um, there's debris blocking the door from being able to be opened. Um, but you could crawl out of the wall, bimp. Hey, uh, if, if there's no other way to unlock that, I found a hole back here I could crawl through. Well, I guess we might as well give it a try to open it, open the front door. I'm gonna try and open the door. Uh, roll me a strength. Do you want advantage on that? Yeah. Um, is it obvious that he looks like he's about to try and break the door open? Uh, I'd say so. Hmm. Do I really want to waste a second level spell on this? No. I mean, I was about to. Oh. You have more spells than me, probably, though. You have the same amount of spell slots. Nah. Four first That's levels you. and three second levels. Yeah, but you have arcane recovery. That's true. Anybody else get, like, a super echoey effect on that? Yeah, I love it when that happens. I'm not going to do it then. I won't do it. Yeah. So I do, I'm just doing a normal thing? Yes. Athletics or strength? Okay, 22. Um, how do you go about trying to open the door? Um... I, I what kind of door is it? Is it like a door knob or is it like a It's a push door, but the uh you cannot push it open because well, uh, without if you were trying like casually, you cannot push it open. I think I just treat it like one of those really heavy doors. Where I just like try to push on it with my shoulder and I push hard enough to to check. Okay. And you go ahead and you break the door open. Um, breaking a plank that was placed in uh, placed in the door handles. So it's like it's like one of those door handles that you can slip something in. I look around. He just looks to Enton like, "Good job. That 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 was that was really mean on their part, and also a really really pitiful attempt at trapping us." I just wanted to inconvenience you. Is there someone around? You don't know that. You could, you could guess. No, we can't. We don't know no. them. 
What if it, it right. was extremely malicious and they were trying to send us forward so that they could push us into their trap and murder us? Just shrugs. I'm gonna still look for books because I still want to try and find any cool books that are in here. Does Anton Can I make a new one, like he asked? Uh, if you look down the street, you see them uh, walking away. See who? Lesbians. Uh, the lesbians. Uh, I mean, I just. I guess close the door again. Should keep that open. I put that open stand here. Were they actually were they going north or south? They're going south. Okay, so I stand here. Looking south. I roll an investigation to see if I can find any interesting books. Yeah. God, this is probably the most like unnecessary nat 20 ever <laughs> but it's a nat 20 uh with a plus six for a total of 26 um okay you find a few interesting books and i will uh and these books are up for the taking because they aren't owned by anyone. There's the book Stranger of the Sea. Um, the Devils and Evil Spirits of Bator, Bator uh, mm -hmm. Volume 2. Um, there is The True Believer. Last one is People of the Caves. Okay, could you? S I'm sorry, I was not typing as you were saying those. Could you say the first one again? Stranger of the Sea. I got the second one, and then the third one. Uh, the True Believer. And then the last one. Uh, that was People of the Caves. Alright. Um, what, like... What in particular is, like, drawing Mina's eyes to these? Are they just, like, more well put together than the rest? Or are they, like, really finely gilded? Or are they... Like interestingly bound, or it's, does she like pick look, them up and flip through them? They look clean, uh, cleaner than the rest. So like they aren't destroyed because there are some of them that are all fucked up. But it, these are just random ones you came across. There's nothing like in particular that's too crazy. It's just this caught your eye for some reason, and then you just picked it up and you're like, eh, interesting. You just holds them all, like, lifts them up into her arms and puts probably one or two of them into her, like, bag, and then holds the other two. Um, so I'm just gonna add all those. Um, you're gonna Free keep books. the devils and, yeah, devils and evil spirits of Bator in hand and, like, start flipping through it. It's exactly what it sounds like. Uh... Is it like an encyclopedia of devils? Uh, yeah, of that specific realm. That's super cool and helpful. Um, well, let's roll us a d100. Oh, go on. Holy shit. Oh, no. Um, Mina. No. You get to a page. 
and um, there's an interesting looking devil. Um, while you're looking over this devil, you swear, you swear you see this picture move. It just kind of like, he was like staring off, like his eyes forward, and he just kind of see, see him turn his head a little bit, look at you, and then resume his position. He just kind of squints and looks over at everybody else at whatever they're doing. Is anybody else paying attention to the book? Or are they off doing their own thing? What are y'all up to? I guess I was reading. standing in the door looking south. Spirit's probably chilling near you, but not like actively looking over your shoulder at the book. It's like sitting in a corner or something. Mina, um, I actually the... have a picture of this devil. Oh boy! Uh, his name, his name is scratched out. You cannot see his name. Okay. Uh, I get it, cause uh, old scratch. Scratch is. It's a, it's, it's a name for the devil. Is what? it? Yeah, old scratch is a name for the devil. Never heard oh. that. Oh. Some people are cultured here. No, some people are just bigger nerds than the others. I don't think that one's a uh, nerd boom. thing. Boom. And it's me. I'm the bigger nerd. Okay. Where did you post the picture? Is it in Quest Portal? I'm, I gotta find it really quick. Oh, okay. Wow. It's gonna I rush. I have it ready. I, I just. Well, I thought I just, no, not, I thought... not not you, Grave. Talking to Sterling. I thought oh. you said you already posted it. No, I said I'm gonna post it. Okay, I apologize. Hello. Bless oh, you. Let me search right. Yeah, I was gonna say though, Mina does put her wings back up and activate detect magic just to see if there's anything actually going on with this book or if it was just something weird she saw. This book, not gonna lie, little, little sus. Mild magic aura? Uh, yeah. But she didn't see it earlier? No, it's it only could be... this page. So it was, it was tucked away. You can. Really? You gotta, you gotta type user yourself. Weird. Ooh. I'm excited. Oh, that's a dapper man. Absent.
Mina will just Mina will just come over to whoever is standing nearest, so I believe that's uh spirit. Just go. Does that look weird to you? And show the page. Does it look weird? Should I send the image? Or should I just post it in chat? Okay. Okay, I'll just post it in general. For the sake of... For the sake of simplicity. Strange. It's weird. There's this. He like lifts up and wiggles the page around. This specific page has magic on it, like just a little bit. Weird. That is strange. I'll mess with it more later. Muted on stream. Fuck. Oh. Oh, oh my god. Um... My my thumb might have accidentally bumped and hit the fucking button, damn it. Anyways. Who cares? Uh, Mina found a book. The book moved, looked at Mina, and then uh, it didn't move when Mina showed someone else. He looks like a little dapper scoundrel. Actually, I can post this, because I bought this art. This is art that I um, commissioned. Wait, what? Time ago. That makes this. Oh, okay. I'm sad. <laughs> if you commissioned this art specifically for this campaign, that'd be a lot more work. <laughs> uh, no, I didn't like, commission oh, it specifically for this game. Um, I commissioned it for a different game, but this is just. I like this picture a lot. Mm -hmm. Sure, Gray. Yeah, Mina will like look over to Enton and kind of wave to try to get his attention. Enton. Huh? You were... I had heard at some point that you were looking into devils, right? Yeah, a little. She holds up the book. Come here. Okay. She holds out the book and shows off the page. It's a, I, I found a book about devils. You want to look through it at some point? Okay. I'll, like, take it and see if there's anything helpful in it, I suppose. Yeah, she'll, she'll hand it over. Um. Once again, you see the book turn, and it just kind of looks at you, smiles a bit, and then... You see it move its hand just a little bit, and then it, like, goes back to how it was. Damn. Why'd a new hand touches the beacon. <laughs> yeah, what about oh. spirit? Damn, am I not good enough spirit to Spirit didn't touch the book! Oh. I have to start poking the picture. Nothing happens. I poke it harder. <laughs> Again, nothing happens. Hmm. Let's continue looking through the the rest of the book then. Um, when you flip the page over, there is a ritual on that page. On the opposite side of the page. Same page, opposite side. Oh. Is it in any funky language? 
Uh, yeah. What language? Uh, what's the language of the devils again? Is that abyssal or infernal? Mm. Infernal. Right? Infernal. Yeah, that's yeah. what I thought. Infernal is the language it is in. I don't do that one. Guess Nina, who who's standing over and watching this, the eyes come back into place again, and the words rearrange into something that she can read. Simple enough ritual. No sacrifices needed. Um, Lame. But... Uh, and it doesn't tell you what the ritual does. Fuck that. <laughs> what do I need for this? Um, it technically says you don't need anything, but it doesn't. It also doesn't say what the ritual does. So, um, I'm not going to tell you how to do it because it could do anything, and that's scary. Are there pictures? Uh, there's a picture of a, like, circle, you know? Like, not a circle, but like a... Like a ritual a magic circle? magic circle, yeah. But the ritual tells you how big it needs to be, how many candles you need, and, like, um, the fact that it needs to be in a dark place. <laughs> like, it doesn't have to be dark, because the candles are there, but, like, the it needs to be dark. Well, well, we won't do anything with that. And then an infant's head he hears for now. And Mina reaches out and will take the book and she closes it. Um, I'll, if you, for the sake of, you, if you don't want to actually read through the whole thing, you can if you want to, but um, I can do uh, my one like cool fast reading spell to read through all of it really really fast and any languages that I any languages that are in there I'll be able to read and interpret so if you want I can just go through it myself and then I can tell you the info that you might need by the way that's the only page that had redacted information fun oh okay Should we... Anybody else want to look for books? Or should we go and ask what's her names, why they locked us in here? Oh, shit. It's 9.30, y'all. This is true. True. It is. All right, friends. Before you guys figure out what you're going to do outside of the bookstore, we're going to end it here. Oh, Gives Lord. you a whole week to figure out what you're going to do. Fuck yeah, we've achievement unlocked. We're homophobic now. Now? <laughs> All of us are homophobic now, not just Enton. Ah. Uh. My real life actual heart sunk when they locked this in there. I was like, no. Lesbians oh, can't be lesbian. mean. I love them. You saying I can't be mean? No, I'm <laughs> talking about these ones specifically. I know you're mean. Oh, wow. I don't know. They don't seem pretty mean the whole time. Give the cash. That's a nice book. I mean, they Give seemed. Me. That pretty lady in. I swear to God, I've opened my mouth five times and been interrupted by whatever is playing. <laughs> I'm trying to mute my phone, but I keep playing the video accidentally. <laughs> <laughs> like, I literally kept opening my mouth to say something, and it would, like, I would hear something again. What I was going to say is that they seemed aloof up until this point, but then they just straight up locked us in an abandoned building. Abandoned. And fuck lesbians. Wink. I will not. I was gonna make a joke, but I don't know if I should. 
I made a joke already. Alright. I probably shouldn't. That's you're not allowed. Me neither. I mean, you're allowed if they give you permission and consent to it, so it's fine. That's true. They could just be exploring their sexuality. This is true. Um, how did you guys like uh my brain fucky wucky session? I didn't like it. We were an hour and forty minutes late starting. <laughs> That's valid. It's just really hard because Andrew um is asleep until like four thirty. Um, and I usually wait for him to eat, so we need to eat, we need to do our, like, peopling things, and it sucks. No, you don't. Just, like, I wake don't him up do earlier. And I'm, look at me, I'm I can't. fine. I literally cannot wake him up earlier. He gets off of work, and he gets here at, like, 8 a.m. But I mean, like, the stuff that we did was plenty of fun. We just admittedly didn't get through a whole lot. Yeah. I dozed off, and when ahead. I woke up, we were docked. <laughs> <laughs> I, went, I fell asleep at my computer when the captain, like, pulled me outside. And then I woke up, and we were docked. So it's like... No, like, IRL, I fell asleep on the car ride and woke up when we got to our destination. <laughs> we're not even at our destination yet, though. Yeah, we're, we're, this is just like a pit stop in the yeah. middle. Now I got it. But, uh... Where the fuck did Gengar go? Oh, oh there he is. Ginger. Oh Losing your boy. Do you lose a boy, Gray? He, he was right behind me. Oh my god. But now, like, you, re you really put a, an unknown ritual in the hands of the problematic knowledge seeker. Shrug. He's also willing to do it with a friend. Maybe. It's the buddy system, after all. Yeah. I mean, it's totally not gonna, like, sneak up to the crow's nest and do it at night randomly someday. I feel like there's gonna be... Why Why are you gonna inflict that on the innocent people of our ship? What if he's evil? They're not <laughs> innocent. Some of know. them locked us away, and therefore they're all evil. That's true. All true, right? We are realized here. Really shit. That's oh, true. I gotta, I gotta run to go use the bathroom real quick, so I'll be back in a little I'll while. I'll fall in. But if if everybody's already dispersed by the time I get back, which I imagine you'll probably be around for a while, good night in case I take longer than I imagined. It's fine, you're not Andrew. Oof. That's fair. <sighs> Is oh, it time God. for me to go to sleep now? No. Why not? Celasta. But sleep. Celesta. But there's a bed right there. Yeah, but that takes effort to go to. You have to get all the way up, walk well, all the I'm way there. You're not already in it. Almost. But what if he was? Oh, great. Shut up. <laughs> You're supposed to convince him to play Celesta, Crown of the Magister. I don't have that game. I'm pretty so sure that game doesn't it. exist. I don't. I don't care if you don't have that game. Uh, you want to do it for me because you love. I don't me. have that game. Yes, you do. We played it together. That doesn't sound right. It does, Devin. I saw you in here. This is true, right? Wait, no. Yeah, he's still here. I love. He's not here. I refreshed the viewer list, and he's no longer here. God damn it! Now you just look like an idiot. I do. <laughs> Talking to no one. I, that's true. Embarrassing. So embarrassing, in fact, that anyone talk to you anymore. I could just leave and go to my bed right now. Nah, because you, you made last me time. feel embarrassed. No, I didn't. 
you don't feel anything ever. I do feel embarrassed when I'm with other people and I don't like to be. Yeah, but Celeste, the crown of the Magister. Your boy, Pimbly Nimbly. Pimbly Nimbly is the hottest boy. See, you should play him. There's not enough romance. You don't know that. I do know. Could be later. The one who said that we played it. I want there to be more one-sided romances where I can break people's hearts by them falling for me and me saying, I'm sorry, I can't. Damn. What if you did it anyways? Then I'd probably do it anyway. I, I forgot what I said already, so... You said, I'm what gonna... if I do it anyways? Oh. And then I said, then I'd probably do it anyway. Yeah, see? So do it anyways. I don't think I will, though. Why not? Because there are no what ifs, and you just said, what if I do it anyway? Damn. But you should so play I anyways. Nah, now you night everybody. Devin quit his job and you're going to treat him like this? Yeah, I will. How dare you. Oh. Bye. Bye. I'm going to fight Booter one day. Do it. I know where he lives. Do it. People suck. True. Yeah. Like those damn lesbians that locked us in a library. Hey, yo. I have Book a grudge shot. for life now. <laughs> Let's kill them. What? 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 You didn't hear anything. I did. No, you didn't. Whip it. Whip it? Clip. Oh. Uh... I think we should do it, though. I dropped my hat. Do, like, I... killable lesbians? Yeah. No. It'll teach people not to fuck with us. People already know not to fuck with us. Then not why do they fuck apparently. with us? <laughs> Because they they're, are amongst they're the be gay slim crimes. part of the population. <laughs> what if we have them hang? No. Why not? I have a I have a good I have a good feeling that Neville Cred and who's that other guy? Enton. Enton and Neville Cred align more on their moral compass than uh, wherever the fuck Bimp's moral compass is at. I have such a good feeling they're going to have to confront Bimp at some point in session 38. It's my guess. It's my guess when it's going to bubble over. Hey, hey. What I'm saying right now has nothing to do with what Bimp thinks. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, I mean, it sounds like something Bimp might say. Rude. I don't think we kill people. I don't think we rule, like, ruthlessly. I also, like... Does it feel weird that a bunch of fucking children are gonna try to overthrow I did it. a... It a took, government? like, four hours, but I finally power-washed it all. <laughs> oh, my good job. It, it, I mean, it does feel weird, because, you know, it's not... We're not used to this type of media where children are given vast amounts of power just like that because the god said so what do you mean we all saw that show on cbs like kid nation nope never heard of it wait really all the like react streamers and youtubers like have gone through it it's like kids were given an entire town to run for, like... i feel offended that you think i watch react streamers i feel like you do i don't mm, who do you watch uh 
mainly it's Frost Prime and Giant Grand Games at the moment. A, Main, a let's they're, play. Yeah, no, no. He, they're mainly STS and uh, StarCraft players. Ooh. One of those. I like to play the Spire in StarCraft, yes. You. Yeah. I have 1,500 hours on Slay the Spire. Damn. Is, uh, Damn. I just found a map of Mina's home. A large home number. Village. What'd you say, Chris? He's not here. Yeah, Mina went to the bathroom. I know. I'm excited to I see this. Like, I don't really remember, but I think it was like, that's a lot of time. It's gotta be... Like thirteen minutes by now. Oh, it's not, it's not even ten weeks of time. Never mind. What? It's not even ten weeks of time. What is that? You're fifteen hundred hours. Oh. I was like, what I learned in Sponge from SpongeBob is there's a hundred and sixty-eight hours in a week. So add a zero, sixteen hundred and eighty. It's ten weeks of time. What if I told you that 700, no, yes, 700 of, the, of those hours were within the last 13 months? Yeah. So you spent like five weeks of your time playing this game. I mean, it makes sense. You're like a college student, right? Yeah. Yeah. I don't want to know how much time I spent playing leagued in college. You, you're a league player. Not Disgusting. I say as an ex league player. <laughs> Disgusting. Yeah, I, found your, I I found your village. Kind of like the, the port is. I need to like rotate this map a little bit. But, Get uh, rotated. Get rotated, as as I lovingly always say. Get rotated, biatch. As if you're not copying that one GIF. I am copying that one GIF. Shark rotation. Let me see if it got rotated properly. Perfect. Perfect. Hiya. Hiya. Oh, wait a minute. Let me go here. Hi. Hi. Yeah. Hi. Nope, this is not too big of a file. Shouldn't be. Can you? Thank you. Did it send to you? Mm-hmm. Ooh. I didn't realize they were talking about my village. Yeah. <laughs> it's legitimately um, what I said. <laughs> I well I I didn't know that you were talking to me specifically. I thought I did. That's fair. Great. No, Grace specifically said your name. I'm. I'm sorry. I was. I. I apologize. Don't make me to feel bad. I will. That's like super high res too. You can zoom like way in. I know, right? Frickin', Mina grew up in frickin' Mofu Mofu Village from Monster Hunter. That Monster Hunter player. League of Legends player? Actually, League of Legends player. Still better than any Monster Hunter player. Or worse. You know no, I mean. no, you said it. You said it. God, you said I better. You. <laughs> don't mess up next time. Don't uh, be a... Don't... I'm bad at speaking. Don't be a butthead. No. Yeah. No, I'll be whatever I want to be. Fucking loser. 
Don't the monster gay. hunter player. Hey, I'm the monster hunter player. So is great. I'm also the monster oh. hunter player. Monster Hunter's a good game. It is a good game. I never got into it. Never Debatable, into really. It. Now, Fire Emblem, that's a cringe game. God, who would play that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, that's <laughs> my cue to leave. Wow, dude hates Fire Emblem that bad. Damn. I've never played, but I did like Roy in Super Smash Bros. for the regular Wii U. So it wasn't the... Okay. No, no. Ooh, I'm tired. It's, it's like 7 a.m. here. Oh, it's not. Shut what? Up. Go no to bed. way. It was he's like tired. eleven an hour ago. <laughs> That's he's try. He is a time traveler, so. That's true. You guys are all gaslighting me, trying to tell me it's not when it is. Gosh, don't gatekeep girl boss I'm not, time. I'm not gate. I'm not gaslighting you. I agreed with you. Wow, can you stop gatekeeping, gaslighting me right now? No, you're uh, the one gatekeeping. Girl bossing? You're the one gatekeeping, gaslighting you right now by telling people not to gaslight you. No, hashtag girl boss. You need to chill out. I'm a girl boss. I can't chill out. Wow, now you're gatekeeping, chilling out from girl bosses. I'm gatekeeping, chilling out from myself. No. So it's because you're a girl boss. No, I didn't. So I'm a girl boss. I can't. I've never out. said that before. You clip. I'm getting a clip. <laughs> I don't care enough to get this clip, but I'll. You know, okay. I need the receipt. No, I'm. Ah, yeah, oh, jeez. All right, bye. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I want, I want to play the new Fire Emblem so bad, and I've been watching Kiara play it, but it's also really frustrating because sometimes Kiara won't do something right, and I get mad at about it. Because why I only like, watch people who are better me at a game that I'm watching? It's like for real. There's an armored unit, and she's just like, "Oh, I'm gonna throw a sword at it." It's like you have a magic user right there, Kiara, please. I'm just gonna do what I did and just hyper level everyone. So no matter what type of unit they are, my units one shot them. Oh god, I do that with Edelgard all the time. It's easy to do with a flying unit. Just send them in, and then when they oh Pet yeah, Edelgard them. and Petra are like my two. I can literally throw them into an entire horde group of enemies, and they'll come out with like one damage taken and fifty extra kills. Yeah. I was playing through Fire Emblem Awakening on, like, emulator. Um, I, oh God, I can't remember their names now. But it was, it was, it was Robin and the one, like, uh, like, sort of orange-haired, um, like, tomboy girl character. What's her name? Oh, I know who you're talking about, but I can't, I'm just gonna Google Fire Emblem yeah. Awakening characters. Uh... Sully? Yes. Sully. Because I couldn't have them be gay, so I just made them very, very strong. Together. Oh my god. I That's like... I wanted to play the old like Awakening is okay because it's got um Crom and I might be gay, but that is a himbo I can get behind. Agreed. But Fates was is rough because there was no dudes that were tolerable and the only uh gay female love interest was uh tied to one specific route. And tied to post ti like a time skip, so not only do you have to get to like a specific character to s support someone else to have that character, you are then romancing the child of your friend. Oh yeah, that's weird. 
Yeah. Oh. I found a cool map. Well. Mina would like it especially. <clears throat> Is it funky and strange? I sure do love me some funky and strange. <laughs> Whoa, it is funky and strange. We'd, we'd have to get... We'd have to mess up really, really bad for to, to have this used in the game. I'm going to post it in general so everybody can see. Fair. We'd have to mess up pretty bad. I want to go here. We just we're just doing some sea travel. Nice. That was lovely. Oh. We had a um, like an in training service dog at our high school, for like a year, whose name was Scout. Yeah. Relatively. I'm That's gonna, badass. I'm gonna dip. Okay. Bye-bye. Nighty-night. That is wonderful. Ah, that's super cool.
need to do more art again. I haven't drawn in a while. I need to. I need to do that. I need to draw Mina's new clothing, her new outfit. I tried to sit down and draw it a while ago, but my brain just wouldn't spit it out. Whoa. She looks very, like, early 2000s anime. Wow. Okay. Bye -bye. Okay, goodbye, everybody.